BBC One HD, it's fun all the way with CBBC. This is not a fairy tale. Or is it? <laughs> For hundreds of years, only the most unfortunate are summoned to the tower, ready to take on the voice and her dark magical forces. There are kicks and challenges on every floor, and someone not to be trusted. Only one will escape with the key of freedom, and the rest... You're trapped! Ever after. <laughs> Crumble wads! Ah, not a moment to myself! Yet another bobbing craft full of unfortunates ready to take on the tower. Well, I hope they're worth the effort. <laughs> Here they come. This lot are from Fulham. There's Laurum, he used to be a cheese grater. Noah is free from polyunsaturates. Saeed hatched from a golden egg. Hudden, she wants wax the penguin. Gantu is an ironing board. And Erissa once went to school on a biscuit. There. <laughs> like all those before them, they'll be imprisoned at the top of the tower. They must work as a team to complete challenges and escape each floor. But one of them cannot be trusted, the saboteur. Only one will leave with the key of freedom and the rest. That's right. Trapped! <laughs> On each floor, a new saboteur will be chosen. It's up to you to uncover who it is. Remember everything you see as you journey through the tower. You may need it to win the key of freedom. Not all of you will get that far. Some of you will be staying here a very long time. Told you! Floor six. Mutternot's Tales. Line up! Noise holes. We're off to the tower library. A place for everything and everything in its place. Miss Mutternot is not happy. <coughs> the tower library is completely confuddled. Unfortunates must carefully put the books back in their rightful place, but the tower is prone to power cuts and someone is trying to upset the librarian. <coughs> One of them cannot be trusted. But who will it be? Laurum, do not react. You are the saboteur. You're the only one who can hear my voice. When the lights go out, it will be pitch black. This is your chance to cause chaos and ensure your team fail this challenge. I will guide you through your whisper clip. <laughs> Top of the tower, and Laurum is the first saboteur. Will he get away with it? Unfortunate. To pass, you must have all the books in place at the end of 90 seconds. Let the challenge begin now! Laurum, don't work on your own. It looks suspicious. Get someone to help you. Oh, there's one here. No, come help me. Perfect. Look busy. Yeah. Laurum, when the lights go out, stand where you can cause most damage. There's a power cut coming. Three, two, one, now! Wait. Go! Yes! Is that it? Next time, you need to knock more over. Remember, Laurum, the more books you knock down, the harder it will be for your team. Okay, come this way, this way. Ah, Erissa's knocked them down. Did you see that? Next power cut is coming. Three, two, one, now! Brilliant! You've got them all! Stay where you are, Laurum, but spring into action when the lights come back on. 
You must now vote for who you think the saboteur was and why. Laurem, who did you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was Saeed because he wasn't helping us when we were fixing the books. No. I also think it was Saeed because every time we were helping, Saeed would accidentally drop the books. Saeed. I think the saboteur was no because every time there was a blackout, the books were always falling next to her. Hooden. I think the saboteur was Noor because the books were always falling next to her. Gantu. I think it was Saeed because whenever the blackout ended, he wasn't at his usual place. Erisa, who do you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was Saeed because the books always fell beside him. You have voted for Saeed. I can now reveal the saboteur was in fact Laura. Ah. Saeed, you will not be leaving this room. The others are free to pass to the next floor. Oh, framed good and proper. Saeed, any last words? I'm upset that I got trapped first, but I wish the rest of the team lots of luck. Fortunate Saeed, you're trapped ever after. <laughs> Poor little Saeed, it's all been a fix. Alone with Miss Mutternot, trapped on floor six. Floor five, poisoned hollows. What's worse than a poisoned apple? Twelve poisoned apples! <laughs> Never stray from the path and never pick a wind-fallen apple. Especially if it's poisoned. Unfortunates must make a circle of poison apples. Once complete, they must hide in the hollows. But listen out. When the owl hoots twice, it means someone has broken the circle of trust. But who will it be? No, do not react. You are the saboteur. It is your job to ensure the circle is not complete at the end of the challenge. I will tell you when it is safe to come out and destroy the circle. You will have five seconds from the moment you touch the first apple. I will guide you through your whisper clip. Oh, Sabtastic! It's no! Unfortunates. To pass, the circle of poisoned apples must be complete at the end of 90 seconds. Let the challenge begin now! No, play along with the others. Oh, come on. Come, come on, 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 turn it off. That's it. Dry the team. Turn it, turn it, turn it, turn it yes. Okay, that's it. Circle complete. I'll tell you when it's safe. Wait. Move now. Come on, quickly. Destroy it. <laughs> in, in. Out with the others. Don't be slow or they'll suspend you. Help them. Come on. Next time, think about where you want to make the apples fall. You're doing well. Circle complete. In, in, in. Wait. Come out now. Come on! Wreck it! Do more! Spin it! Out, out, out! 30 seconds. Help them complete the circle so you can get out and destroy it again. It could be your last chance. Circle complete. Wait for it! 
the coast is clear. Go, go, go! Brilliant. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Come out with the others. But don't let them complete it. Your time is up! You have failed! Miserably! <laughs> oh dear! Bad luck, team! Ooh. You must now vote for who you think the saboteur was and why. Nor, who did you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was Gantu because every time I saw the apples go, I saw them on his side. Hooden. I think the saboteur was Gantu as well, because when we were spinning around the table, he didn't seem to be doing very much. Gantu. I think the saboteur was an all because she kept on dropping the apples. Erisa. I think the saboteur was Gantu because the apples always fell on his side. Laurum. Who do you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was no because she kept on um, not helping and throwing the apples on my side. You have voted for Gantu. I can now reveal the saboteur was in fact No. <laughs> Gantu, you will not be leaving this room. The others could still win the key of freedom and are free to pass to the next floor. Oh, stitched up. <laughs> Gantu, any last words? I'm devastated that I'm trapped, but seriously, am I gonna stay here forever? Poor unfortunate Gantu. You're trapped! Ever after. Poor little Gantu, will he survive? Now he's trapped in the hollows, alone on floor five. Floor four, split end. It'll take more than a trip to the salon to sort this one out. There once was a girl, approach if you dare. Never combed it or cut it, now she's trapped by her hair. Split ends is her name, and the poor thing's in knots. Unfortunate must gently untie three bows from her tangled plait without disturbing her. If she screams three times, it's all over. Beware, someone will be out to upset her. But who will it be? Erissa, do not react. You are the saboteur. I will tell you which bow will settle split ends in each bunch. You must use your powers of persuasion to make the others fail. But don't be too obvious, or they'll suspect you. I will guide you through your whisper clip. <laughs> the saboteur is Erissa, but will she blow her cover? Unfortunate. To pass, you must successfully remove three bows without disturbing split ends. Let the challenge begin now! Um, I think we're going the green. Seven. Erissa, the yellow bow is the screamer. Not sure. I think green's quite safe. Take control. Okay. You guys will start with this one. Yeah. Why are you oh, so sure about green? I think it is. Has it yellow? Great! Yeah. Oh, Dylan, what do you think it is? She thinks green. I think green. Are you going to take it off? Okay. Go on, take it off. Delicately, so. Delicately, careful. Don't make her. He's going for it. It's scary. This is a great start. Come on, Lauren. Please don't scream. Just wait. This time, the green bow is the screamer. Okay, maybe yeah, red this time. This one now. Should we go for red? Color? Red. Hooden suggested green before. Hooden, you thought the green one yeah, was, not it? Yeah, I So should we take the green one? Let's try green. Yeah, try the green should one. Should we try the green one? Okay, they've agreed. Leave it. <laughs> the others are nervous. Careful. And so they should be. Please giggle. Stop. Please giggle, please giggle. Please giggle. <laughs> Oh Excellent. Okay, this yeah. one is going for red. I think it's the yellow bow is the screamer this time. So oh, maybe uh, red. Because people would think red go, is a bad one. Let's right, go around. Let's go around. 
Okay. If you guys think Fred, go choose the rare one. Good idea. At least you'll earn their trust. I picked it. I think it's a good one. Okay, let's just do this. Because like, we haven't picked okay. Fred yet. If she screams, she screams. Let's do this. If she doesn't, she doesn't. Come on, Larry. Come on, Larry. Yeah. I get yeah. You're doing well. Let them have this. You only need one more. Oh, she's moving your way. Remember to look pleased. So I think that I think she's going to scream. Be careful, Larry. I'm scared. I'm scared. Perhaps he needs some help. It's going to be a good one. To make yeah, but we need to do it. Yeah. Please. Please don't scream. This time, the red bow is the screamer. Oh, come on. This yes. one, I think yellow. I don't know why, I just have it. It should be in a colour. I think it's going to be the same colour now. Yeah. Because that yeah. red was no, wait. Careful. Don't give yourself away. That could be a trick. Maybe should we yellow. Do, should we do... Let's yeah, do let's one. try yellow. Let's try yellow. Do you guys think yellow? Yeah. This is risky. Let's do the yellow. Yeah, yeah, let's do the yellow. Okay, we'll go yellow. That will be another one to them. Here we go. Remember to celebrate with the others. Yes. <laughs> Erisa, red is the last screamer. I need this one. We're okay. on this. Yellow. Like, I don't know, green. No, not... Make them pick red or you're trapped. Green. Yes. Let's, let's do the red one because, like, no, the Erisa. red one, even though it looks like it's the Why dangerous... Why do you think red's the mark? It was good before. It's, um, this one. Yeah, she giggled. Like, yeah, but like, uh, I, but then, how but do you know she's going to giggle? We haven't picked green yeah. yet, and it's red, yellow. Maybe there's a pattern. You could just use green now. Hands right. up for green. I think green's a good colour. I mean. Yeah. They're running away with it. Do something. Let's try it. Come on. Oh, Stop them. Uh, she screams, she screams. You will be trapped. Please, please. please. Laram. Yeah. Because look, you say that one. Oh, They're not listening. They scream. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes! Unfortunate, you have passed. <sighs> passed? What was she thinking? You have passed. Therefore, the saboteur is automatically locked in the room. But before I reveal the unlucky unfortunate, who do you think the saboteur was and why? Hoodum. I think Arissa was the saboteur because when we were taking the bows off and we got them right, she didn't celebrate with us, so she just looked a bit down. Arissa. I think the saboteur was Noel because she wasn't helping the team. Laura. I think the saboteur was Arissa because she wasn't celebrating with us when we got the right ribbons. Noel, who do you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was Arissa, because every time we got one right, she'd always disagree and wouldn't celebrate with us. You have voted for Erissa. I can now reveal the saboteur was, in fact... Erissa. I knew it. I knew it. I did celebrate her. Erissa, you failed to sabotage the challenge and you were detected. Therefore, you will not be leaving this room. The others are free to pass to the next floor. <laughs> Automatic tropification. <laughs> Erissa, any last words? Yes, I would just like to say that I'm going to miss everyone. Poor, unfortunate Erissa. <laughs> You're trapped! Thereafter. <laughs> Poor little Erissa. Her game had a flaw. Not sneaky enough. So she's trapped on floor four. Oh. Oh. What? Hello? Hello? Oh! <laughs> it's Miss Mutternot on the sixth floor. Eh? Don't shush yourself, you spooky bookkeeper! Ooh! <laughs> now, where were we? Oh, yes! <laughs> Saeed is trapped on floor six. Gantu is trapped on floor five. And poor little Erissa is trapped on floor four. <laughs> floor three! Scallywag wood! <laughs> Now, if you can't see the wood for the trees, then you need new goggles box! 
If you go down to Scalawag Wood, you're sure of a big surprise. You'll see Esme's transformations. You won't believe your eyes. She turns chickens into creatures. But sometimes, when they're out, she'll catch and transform Scalawags. So, unfortunates, look out! To escape this floor, unfortunates must find two Scalawags transformed by Esme. Find two chickens, and it's all over. Remember, one of them is not to be trusted. But who is it? Hoodan, do not react. You are the saboteur. It is your job to ensure your team fail this challenge. On Esme's cart, you will find a rabbit, dove, lizard, lovebird, snail, chinchilla, snake, toad, and cockroach. Guide your team away from the creatures with feathers or fur. These will be the scallywags. I will guide you through your whisper clip. It's Hudden! Sab it up! Unfortunates. To pass, you must find two scallywags. Let the challenge begin. Now! So which one do you pick first? Hudden, you want them to pick creatures without feathers or fur. The lizard, snake, toad, or cockroach. So, which one's it gonna be? The so frog, frog maybe. The toad. Brilliant! Maybe for ugly the one. chinchilla. No, something without feathers or fur. Manipulate the team. I think maybe the chinchilla. Okay. I don't know. It, whatever you decide. How about this? Because this just doesn't look good in it. Lara and thinks the cockroach. What are you gonna go for? That'll do. Cockroach. The cockroach. Cockroach. Yeah. Lucky you. <laughs> Hello. Oh, look at him, a little cockroach. Is this gonna be a scallywag or a chicken? Hopefully a scallywag. Hopefully, yes. Well acted. Let's place him in the tree of transformation. Hudden, the key with this game is to blend in, and you're doing brilliantly. <laughs> Nicely done. Remember, Anything without feathers or fur. A plain old chicken. Oh, One more and you fail. Maybe we could. Do you understand? Oh yes. <laughs> let's do the bird here this time. No. So. I think bird. Bird. Let's okay. go. You're going. Yeah, let's go for bird. Let's keep. Bird. bird. Yes. So. Be positive with this one. Hooden, you'll have to be quicker next time. Let's see how good you are at acting now. Yes! Yes, yes team, you have done. Oh, you. Yes. Yes. But, but, uh, but, uh, love you need to find one more. If you find a chicken, you will fail. Goal. You must take control. Yeah. Very useful. Let's find the snake. I think yeah. it's really nice. I don't oh, think it's cute. But but the love, the love, 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 Suggest something else. No feathers, no fur. Oh, the lizard. Good. I haven't picked any animals that like walk. Yes. Hurry up! Oh, no. <laughs> I haven't got all day. Don't get too close. Don't get too close. They're going for it. So, what have you picked? The lizard. Remember, you're not sure. The lizard. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah. 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 Here we go. Oh, please, if it's a chicken, it'll be that. You're quite the actress, Hooden. Stand back! Please! Oh, no! Oh, oh, you should have gone for that. Unfortunate! You have failed! Oh! Magnificent! Excellent! You must now vote for who you think the saboteur was and why. Laurem, who did you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was no, because she kept on picking the wrong animals. No. I think the saboteur was Laurem because he wasn't making any choices. He was just agreeing with everything we said. Hudden, who do you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was Laurem because most of the main decisions were up to him. You have voted for Laurem. I can now reveal the saboteur was in fact... Hudden. Laurem, you will not be leaving this room. Hudden and Noor will go head to head in the fight for freedom. Sorry, Laurem. 
Oh, what a shame. <laughs>